Welcome to our Power Project tutorials. For more resources, including a downloadable manual, select the link below. In my experience, I find that the more detail you have in your outline structure, the easier it is to be able to deal with the activities within that structure. And I read it somewhere in a uh, report years ago, some kind of paper, that the human brain can only keep up with six to nine items at one time, like keeping that kind of stuff in your memory. So I typically will try to keep activities in groups of uh, 10 or less. And so in this case, if I decided I wanted to break these finishes, maybe I want to just break out the rough ends from my interior finishes. Well, I can do that right now. Everything is under the title interiors. But if I go over here into my interior frame and my plumbing, mechanical, rough insulation, I'm going to all the way up through insulation. I'm going to summarize those on my home ribbon. I can go up here and I can say summarize and I'll call this rough ends. It added that line, that summary bar for my rough ends. And I'm going to go down here in my drywall. I'm going to highlight, highlight this, hold my shift key all the way down to test and balance. And I'm going to summarize those. It added that, inserted that summary into my interior finishes. Notice now over here in my outline, it's broken out my rough ends and my interior finishes. I can go back up here to my appearance and add another level so that I can see my uh, my new items that I just added. I'm going to right. So there are my interior finishes, my interior rough ends. And here's my complete building schedule. Very easy to get activities in there. Thanks for watching our tutorial. Don't forget to share, like and subscribe to our channel. Please leave comments.